Aloha. I'd like to use this film to thank some of the many people on Molokai, Lanai, and Maui who've helped me with my District 7 Senate campaign, who made the process fair and enjoyable, or just stopped to chat. I'd even like to thank the big guy who got in my face and the other guy who called me Lolo. I've learned from you too. It's my first campaign for office, so I didn't know what to expect, but I love the opportunity to meet everyone and hear their concerns. I honestly don't know how you could be a successful official if you didn't do this all the time. And I guess I'm even more suspicious of those who simply spend big bucks on one-way messaging. So this film is dedicated to certain troublemakers in the House and Senate and their wonderful staff who first urged me to pull papers. To the amused neighbors who signed and the diligent election officials who checked my signatures down to the wire. To Senators Slom, He, and Chan Oakland who showed us that doing the right thing just takes courage and common sense. To Grandma Bella who put us up in her beautiful villa. To the Kauai Ohana and Halualani Ohana. To Auntie Sissy and Uncle Francis who shared their wisdom. To Cousin John who gathered some of the wonderful people of Hana. To the Lani family who told their story. To the Maui Tea Party who graciously invited me to speak. To Joe Blackburn who offered help and advice. And to the manager of Fat Burger who subjected his customers to a singing politician. To the Haku Baldwin Equestrian Center who let us take a break and learn about their wonderful program. To the organizers and audience of the Makawao Paniolo Parade who aren't afraid of rain. To the engineers and journalists at Akaku who bend over backwards to keep the public informed and the debates fair. To my brothers Kaulana, Gary, and Uncle Robin who organized Lanai and hosted us and taught us that the best restaurant in the state is probably a potluck in Lanai. To my wife, brother, parents, and ohana on Molokai who took care of my children and supported me in thousands of ways. To Auntie Juanita who registered voters and Uncle Sam Hulu who stars in our films and makes us all laugh. By the way, the high point of the campaign may have been when someone recognized Uncle Sam and yelled from across the street, Look, it's Uncle Sam! And that other guy. To Alex Bode, who showed us his Waiki Kena project in Haiku, where young people learn sustainability and caring for the land. I never knew a Renault sedan could handle off-roading so well. Oops. To the charming members of the senior centers of Molokai, Lanai, and Maui, who convinced me to sing more and talk less. To the faculty, staff of Maui Community College who shared their concerns about development and their special love for Molokai. To all those who generously donated to my campaign and made it possible to travel between islands. To Henry Curtis and his wife Kat and to all the government energy experts who helped us understand and keep our facts straight. To the editor and journalist at Civil Beat who follow truth wherever it leads and keep us all informed. And above all, to filmmaker P.F. Bentley, AKA The Wizard, who has single-handedly enabled us to get our message out to all of you without taking corporate money and buying TV ads. Finally, and most important, this film is dedicated to all the curious shoppers at the mall and all the residents from Haile Miley to Mauna Loa, who took time out of their day to question a newcomer and decide if he really is crazy. And also to all those, including my gracious opponent, who honked and waved so enthusiastically that I finally stopped feeling like an idiot standing and waving on the side of the highway. Please know that it's a privilege to meet all of you along the way, to hear your mana'o, your hopes and fears, and your concerns for your children's and grandchildren's future. I know I didn't mention everyone by name, but I'm truly grateful to you all. The primary is this Saturday, the 11th. For the final week, we will be campaigning in Maui, in part to investigate reports of bikini-clad helm for Senate sign waivers near Paia. By the way, a big mahalo to those who helped put up signs with Uncle Johnny Mac. I am humbled by this campaign 
and embarrassed to have asked you to give up your right to vote for party candidates in order to vote for me on the nonpartisan ballot. Creating a truly open primary is one of the first things we need to fix. No matter what the outcome, I will continue the fight with Ayaloha Molokai to make government more open and honest and to halt these big boondago wind projects. I'm eager to join with the many new allies we've made across the district and indeed around the state. Win or lose, we have started a debate about the direction of government and the need for a more open process. If I do get into the general election, I am looking forward to bringing all our new friends into the campaign and trying to set an example of the kind of politics we clearly need and that you all deserve. Mahalo and God bless. I am Kanoho Wailuku Helm and I approve this message.